everyone, it's Mandy from Designs by Miss Mandy. Today I'm stepping outside of Adobe Illustrator for just a minute to address a question I get all the time, and that's how do I change the color of black and white graphics? And specifically, how to accomplish this outside of paid design tools like Adobe Photoshop or Illustrator? So as far as free design programs go, Canva is one that most people are familiar with these days, or at least have heard of. So today I'm going to be quickly showing you how to alter the color of a piece of clip art using Canva. So here I am at canva.com and I'm just going to open a blank file. I'll just do a square one, 10 by 10 and click create new design. So what you're going to do is navigate to your uploads panel and upload an image that you want to use. So I have this set of swans that I designed a while back. It's available on my website um, as part of a cute lovebird set. So if you want it, I'll put a link in the description for you. Okay, once your design is uploaded, you can just click on it and drag it right onto your artboard. From there, you can adjust it however you'd like. You can scale it up and down. Um, rotate it around, whatever you want to do, have some fun with it. I'll maybe just put them like this, this is kind of fun. Okay, and then as far as changing the color goes, what you'll need to do is navigate to adjust, and then you're going to start by turning the brightness all the way up, and then using your tint slider to change the color to whatever you want it to be. You can change it to be more red or orange, green, you get the idea. Um, and then you can use some of the other sliders. Some of them don't really do much as far as color changing goes. Um, some of them will make your um, colors more vibrant. So you can kind of just play around with those until you kind of have the color that you want. You can also use things like the transparency slider um, if you want to make it look more like a watermark or just fade out the design a little bit, uh, downplay it in the background or whatever you have in mind. Um, whenever you have your uh, design where you want it, all you need to do is click the download uh, button in the upper right hand corner and select the file type that you want to use. So um, PNG is, like it says, it's suggested. Um, if you want it to have a transparent background, you will have to use the paid version of Canva. There's no real way of getting around that. So if transparency is um, important to you, then you're just gonna have to, to pay for that. Uh, otherwise, you can just um, select the file type and hit download. So there you go. Unfortunately, changing the color of graphics in Canva isn't super intuitive. It's not like you can just click on your image and select a color. I kind of wish it was. It's a bummer that's not. Um, but if you're new to design and you're just looking for a free way to incorporate cute graphics that you may have gotten from Etsy, Creative Market, or my awesome website into your projects, then this is a good way to make it happen. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial. Feel free to let me know if you have any other design topics or questions you'd like me to cover in future videos.